This video demonstrates arithmetic operations in AVR assembly with focus on unsigned arithmetic. Assembly examples will be executed and results displayed on Arduino serial monitor. The AVR assembly instruction set is divided into five types. We have arithmetic and logic instructions, branch, data transfer, bit and bit test, and control instructions. In this video we will focus on arithmetic instructions and more specifically on unsigned arithmetic instructions. Before we begin with the unsigned arithmetic operations we need to revisit the status register and in this video we'll focus on the carry flag, the zero flag, the negative flag and the half carry flag. The carry flag is set whenever there is a carry out from a byte operation. The zero flag is set when the resultant arithmetic operation gives us a zero. The end flag is set whenever the resultant is a negative uh, number. And the edge flag is set whenever there is a carry out from a binary coded decimal operation. Here we have some opcodes related to arithmetic instructions on unsigned numbers. We start with the add instruction and this is the syntax of the instruction in the operand the content of the source register is added to the content of the destination register and the result goes into the destination register and these are the affected flags as an example we want to add these two numbers in R16 and R17 and here the addition in binary the result is 0 so the 0 flag is affected or set and note that we have a carry out from the binary coded decimal addition and we have a carry out from the most significant digit so the carry flag is set and the half carry flag is set and now for a quick demonstration we copy the first number in register R16 second number in R17 we add the two numbers and the result goes into register R16. We also copy the byte in the status register into R19. We compile and run the assembly code and we observe the output on the serial monitor. The first byte is the result 0 and the second byte is the uh, status register A3. The byte in the status register is A3. And as you can see here that the flags affected are carry, zero, and the half carry flag. This next instruction is the subtract instruction and this is the syntax. We have destination minus source and the result goes into the destination. We can check flags N or C to see whether we have a positive or a negative number. For positive number the M flag will be zero and it uh, will be one for negative numbers and for the C flag after each subtraction the value is uh, inverted in this example we are subtracting 23 hexadecimal from 3F and subtraction is done by adding the first number with the two's complement of the second number so the two's complement of 23 is we take the ones complement and then we add one to get the twos complement and this is the result and you can see that the C flag is zero although the there was a carry out here but as I mentioned before after each subtraction the carry flag is inverted so it is now zero and the N flag is zero indicating that the result is a positive number in this next example we demonstrate the subtract operation we copy the first and second number into registers 16 and 17 we subtract the two numbers and the result goes into R16 we copy the byte in status register into R19 and then we compile and run the program and observe the output as you can see the value in the status register is 80 which indicates that the C flag is 0 and the N flag is 0 meaning we have a positive result next we have subtract immediate instruction and this is the syntax 
Here in the operand, we are subtracting an 8-bit number from the destination and the result goes into the destination. As an example, R16 has decimal 23, so we do subtract immediate 23 minus 8 and the result goes into R16. In the AVR instruction set, there is no immediate addition, but it can be done indirectly using the subtract immediate, and this example demonstrates that. This next example demonstrates the subtract immediate operation. In this next example, we perform the add immediate operation indirectly using the subtract immediate instruction. Next we have the multiply instruction where the values in the operand registers are multiplied generating a 16-bit number. The high byte is stored in R1 and the low byte is stored in R0. As an example, we are multiplying here hexadecimal 25 with 65 generating a 16-bit product E99 where the high byte is in R1 and the low byte is in R0. Note that there is no instruction for division in AVR assembly, but we can achieve division indirectly by a repeated subtraction. This will be demonstrated in a future video. In this next example, we are demonstrating the multiplication operation, noting on the serial monitor the 16-bit product. The instructions presented in this video perform arithmetic on 8-bit unsigned numbers. To perform 16-bit arithmetic, we need to use instructions such as add with carry, subtract with carry, subtract with carry from immediate, subtract immediate from word. These instructions will be demonstrated in a future video.